Don't forget to get your tickets now for the Vienna Boys Choir taking place at the Tennessee Williams Theater on February 17th. All right, it's time to hear now from our three favorite women, also known as Three Loud Women. Today's topic is Don't Ask, Don't Tell. Enjoy. <laughs> Hi, and welcome to Three Loud Women. We are here at IKEA Sunrise, and we are part of the IKEA family, and we invite you to be part of the IKEA Family Rewards Program, too. I'm Allison Thompson, also known as Therapy Head. I'm a psychotherapist who believes that therapy can be fun, and I'm here to bring my 20 years of experience to our living room. The IKEA living room. The IKEA living room. <laughs> In case anyone was unclear, that we're uh, at I'm just saying. I'm just saying. Yeah. Sunrise. At Ikea. Sunrise. <laughs> Hi, I'm Stephanie Goldberg Laser. I'm the Florida Keys girl. I'm obsessed with all things food, wine, and travel related, and I bring these passions to Three Loud Women. And I am Tiana McDonald, also known as the In Style Diva, and I'm loud and proud about style, social media, and motherhood. Cheers. Cheers. Cheers ladies. Cheers, ladies. We are big dreamers with big ideas and really big mouths. And <laughs> Stephanie? Yes. What are we talking about today? Today's topic is an interesting one that I don't really understand. I'll be, I'll be quite honest about it. But we are talking about the stigma of therapy. Don't ask, don't tell. Why certain people are embarrassed to talk about it, embarrassed to go to therapy. What's your take on it? I'm, I'm only speaking about my people. <laughs> my, your peeps? And my what, peeps. Your people meaning who? My peeps, my African-American Okay, peeps. so okay. your culture. Yes, my culture. Right. Um, the American Psychological Association reported that 30% of Americans, period, just Americans, do worry about others finding out if they're going to therapy. Mm -hmm. Am I crazy? Mm -hmm. And I'm sure you, this is, hits home to you because. What, being crazy? Yes. No, dealing with the crazies. <laughs> dealing with the crazies. <laughs> being crazy enough being to deal with Being crazy enough to deal with them. Okay. Um, um, some, not, you know, not that. Oh, not that there should not be a that stigma, should be a stigma that. but, um, <laughs> you know, especially, but specifically with African Americans, based on the research that I did, they are the race that is uh, less likely to seek out mental health. Okay. You know, you have to be, according to the research, on your last like limb. Dying, like that is dying. it. There is nobody else on the world to talk in the world okay. to talk to. Now, I I do go to therapy, and it's okay. Well, th thank you for sharing. Yes, I love it. <laughs> but I remember when I told my mother that I was going to therapy. She said, "What do you need therapy for?" Oh. And okay. it's the whole. What are you going to therapy All for? Right. But you know, now she's like, "You need to go to therapy." Well, you know well, here's the deal. I, I mean, if you if you were a diabetic, you wouldn't have a problem getting insulin. If you had a uh, uh, high blood pressure, you wouldn't have. <laughs> problem taking medication it, you know it's tricky because or you might have just adjust your diet it's the, you, well, yeah. uh, if, okay, yeah, okay. If, okay. if it was genetic you paid in the ass um, <laughs> they're ashamed they're but, embarrassed but, 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 but people why? feel but people why? feel that if there is an issue emotionally right. or an issue with your brain which by the way happens to be one of your organs mm -hmm. that that somehow you're weak in going exactly. to therapy it's, it's, a, sign it's a sign of weakness and 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 look I, I i can clearly tell you that that is absolutely not the case because Going to therapy is a sign of strength. Admitting that you need some assistance and seeking out professional help is, in fact, a sign of strength. And I know in the Jewish culture, you know, you're not normal if you don't see a shrink. <laughs> so, <laughs> but it takes a while to get there. But, <laughs> you know, once you, have you ever tried therapy? I have not. Oh, well, she's perfect. Did you? Did you? Really? <laughs> well, with you two around, I need a lot of therapy. Believe me. I know, whatever you call Allison. Well, tell me what's wrong. <laughs> yes, 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 you're right. I just want to go shopping. Yeah. No, what do you she really asks, want? She what do you really that. want? No, I want to buy that. shoes. What's the underlying no, issue? No, I got to go. I got <laughs> stuff to do. <laughs> bye, bye Go get a shrink. Well, you know, the thing is, what's interesting is that it's, it is a very private experience. It is, and it should it be is. private. Um, it's obviously a confidential experience. And it's not an uh, easy decision you know, to and, make. And you're not really crazy going to therapy. I mean, mm -hmm. you know, we make fun of people and we call people crazy in this. But the truth is that everyone struggles with whether it's situational, which mm -hmm. means maybe, you know, you had a death in the family or you're going through a divorce mm -hmm. or your your adolescent child is driving you crazy I'm not talking about myself <laughs> uh, you know or those are situational and or you really could have mental illness where there's a chemical imbalance and something going on in your brain you know it, it, 
in many offices, I don't know if you knew this, but there's an indoor in a therapist's office and an outdoor. Mm -hmm. So you might come into the uh, waiting, like waiting room, room and you check see a whole in. Bunch of people. Most times now it is the waiting room because yeah. there isn't as much stigma related right. to it. But you know, you could come into a waiting room and then when it's your turn for the appointment, you go through a door and the last appointment had already left through the back door. Ah. So mm -hmm. don't get, you know, I know well, you get excited when I, I say know. back door, I but know. you know, we're talking I, about know, therapy. I know we're talking about therapy. <laughs> I don't know what back direction is. I'm just, we're just talking. So it, 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 it takes a lot because it took a lot for me to take that it step did. and say, it did. It was very right. like, you struggle with it. So you're not crazy if you go to therapy. No, I think it's hard it's to ask for and help. And you need to separate sometimes away from your inner circle and get somebody's opinion. Oh, well, well, absolutely. I mean, there's no, you know, going to see a therapist and obviously picking a good therapist, yeah. one you feel comfortable right. with, sure. um, one that one that is going to be non-judgmental is should be a good, solid, cathartic experience for you. And they don't have the biases that come with absolutely. friends, family, mm -hmm. neighbors, spouses, and so forth. So it will On be that a different note, experience. You need to try some therapy. <laughs> well, absolutely. You know I mean, what? I love We're going to have a follow-up episode with her after she went Why to is she therapist. pointing at me? Oh, we're going to send her to therapy? Yes. <laughs> Just one visit. Would you be willing to go for therapy? No, she'll say I have nothing to contribute to this. <laughs> <laughs> She's got nothing. I got nothing. You know, hey, that's a wonderful a thing. With it. I if I would need to, if I felt like I, I would need oh, yeah, to go, yeah. I have a problem yeah. doing it. I you, just you would don't that feel that, that I have that go. need at the moment. Yeah. That's okay. good. All right. Well, well thank, you. thank you. you for, for sharing. <laughs> yes, yes. Yeah, thank you. you anyway, so it doesn't make a difference. You couldn't see me? Well, I wouldn't see either one of you. That would be a conflict of interest for me. Oh. I mean, and I love it you. It would make you not impartial. You know, yeah, you're yeah, my yeah, friend, that's and that's you're true. my colleague, yeah. and, but I'm, I'm extremely ethical, and I don't think that friends Oh, you're ethical? Yes. <laughs> I really don't think that friends you are, should, you should work right, with each other. It's true. Up, it's true. It up. Don't forget to watch us on YouTube, like us on Facebook, and send us a tweet. And go to therapy. And go, to therapy. <laughs> go to therapy. Have a great day. Bye. Bye. Cheers. I'll go to some wine Dark, therapy. Cheers to therapy.